It is now for me just after, but for you it is next time. So let's have a, a pip nap before we do anything. We're not on a schedule this time. So there's no timer being mean to us. And uh, we have quite a lot of hit points as you can see. And our healing rate is also quite high, which means that every t every tick where we would get uh, where we get damage healed, we actually uh, get quite a lot more damage uh, healed. Morlis wants your aunt, the one who never liked you. Hey. Okay, so I remember there's another f job thing we can get here, uh, which we will do before we go into the next area. This is to the temple, I believe. Come on, you slow fuck. <laughs> I think we need to be level 5 or something before our attacks upgrade. Before then, we might actually be better off with uh, brass knuckles or some shit like that. Let's see if I can get that. Tim, that counts as an unarmed weapon. But it will right to our attack. Uh, it's good to see you again, Chosen. How may I help you? Ready for another fight? You have a tongue of pure silver chosen one. Your skill with worlds will open many doors for you. Thank you, mate. Uh, visit the temple again. Take the path to the left chosen one. Lead the temple proper. Okay. Uh, that's fine. Uh, that's not what we wanted, though. We see a young cousin, Nagor. <laughs> you don't see his dog smoke anywhere. Uh, nice. This is what we want. Glad to see you, cousin. I need your help. What do you need help with, mate? Smoke ran off to the hunting grounds and hasn't come back. And now Morlish won't let me go find him. He said it's too dangerous and he's just a dog. I was going to go anyway, but now you're here and uh, you could uh, do it and I wouldn't get in trouble. Sure. Where are the hunting grounds? Uh, <laughs> what did you do? Get hit in the head uh, with a rock. They're on the far side of Hulkun's tent north of the village. Sure. I thought we needed a whistle or something. Dog's over here somewhere, but uh, I hear Bork Bork, and there's a gecko, silver one. Oh, that's a dog, okay. We're gonna punch every single fucking gecko in the game, so. <laughs> skull pole. Pole with human skulls attacks. We seem like we're in a lovely fucking tribe. These aren't actually hostile until I punch them hard. Ah, uh, critical hit for thingy tearing slimy skin off. Very fine. Naturally, I'll respond by kicking it in the head for a low chance of success. That was not a crit, sadly. Nor was that. Come on, Sloyd Foo, don't fail me now. Yo! There we go, plock. Yeah, unconscious. Not quite killed, but. Well, also killed. So Brockflower and Sander Root should be out here, and I seem to recall it was these things, but that's a uh, that's actually mutated corn as far as I know. Yeah, mutated corn stalk. This might be it. There we go. That's a Sander Root. Brockflower looked like again. Okay, these boys are angry now. I'll let you come to me. Come on. I think my sequence is actually so fucking high that I sometimes get double turns. Which is very, very nice. Surprised at the amount of 50% I'm hitting here. Seems to be about half. Actually over half. There we go. You're still alive, aren't you? Yes, you are. There we go. I'm the sort of creature who kills for experience. Basically just to see what it was like. Bring out my punch for a second there. Ah, oh. uh, you, you got me. You may notice my one attack bar, which supposedly is to be one. 
the two slots we have is supposed to be both of our hands when one of them's kick. The manual for this says not to think about it when you have weapons equipped in the, the foot. So we shall not think about it. I attribute all of it to uh, Sloyd Fu, naturally. So what the hell does the Brock flower look like? Aha! Like a little fiery thing. There's one hiding there. I think. Four geckos all together. A literal pixel hunt. Okay, I'm worried I might not be able to get the dog across there if these geckos get pissy when I go over there. And they tend to get pissy when you kick them a lot. <laughs> I need to get them first. Problem is, there's quite. I don't want to fight two at once, but we may have to. Oi, Satan. 61 to hit this one. 50 something now. Okay, he's unconscious. That's good. I'm gonna punch him repeatedly until he's dead. Oh, he's out of range, never mind. Okay, his friend. He's also unconscious. Well, Sloyd Fu, ladies and gentlemen. Directly in the GN center of the brain. So a good tip to when there's green acidic goo is not to step in it. Probably goes for the dog as well. Woof woof. You're gonna follow me now. I guess that's what you're doing. There we go. Idiot dog. It's pretty good. Come on here. Steps directly in the, the green slot despite previous warning. Come here. You fucking hound. Come on. Fuck off. There we go. Hey. Pants mode, that's a good boy. Bad dog. No, don't chastise stop. 100 XP. Could have punched many geckos for this. Hello, you're the chosen. Oh, fuck this. Okay, let's go back to Phoenix and see if we can get him to uh, make some of the crap we got. Ah, chosen. My garden is well. How is yours? I'm all right. The pleasure of these words fills me. Alas, the gods whisper for my ear. Goodbye. Mm. Ah, chosen. Make me some fun powder, mate. May this be of no use. Ah, chosen. Such is More. life. Two creates a third. You will need... B oh, you made both portions. No, I need an extra. God damn. Oh, that actually made quite a lot. Hmm, I think we're done here. We're about to leave the village or whatever it was. Uh, wait, is that a shovel? It fucking is. It's mine. Do you have anything to say now that I help him? I helped you, the guy that you were uh, dick to? No. I leave on fixed Sloyd flu elsewhere. Mm. Talk to her. Do you have a name? No. Aha, I think I can probably steal everything from. No. <laughs> hey, 
Off to find a gek. Yes, but I'd like to ask you some shit. What would you like to know? Tell me the man who traded with our village. Uh, the traders come from Klamath about every two months. There won't be another here for a month or more. We can't show you a few days here to pay a time. Can you tell me about the object I uh, I have from the sacred vault? It looks like a metal water go good. Maybe the vault uh, sent it to us as an omen. Sure. I'm leaving. Fucking all inbreds, me included. Shit. At least we developed the divine Sloyd flu. Fu. Sloyd flu is probably what's killing the children. That or severe inbreeding. Probably the latter. Out we go. Let's climb it. About to doubt it down. Not a single random encounter. Get in there. Arrive at night. Wait till morning. Hey, we got the version that has kids. They were not there in the first one. Is this four? Fucking is. See a very large man covered in dust with a small smile and blank look on his face. Hey Thor. Me Thor. Nice to meet you Thor. Anything interesting happening here lately? Bogman take Moo Moo at night. Thor scared to help Thor. Yes. I'll help you guard the ramen. I'll help you right now. So you can apparently have a really, really uh, profound conversation with, uh, with Thor here if uh, you are as stupid as him. Well, that's basically how you sound, like he does. If uh, if you have uh, less than four intelligence, you sound exactly like him. It's grunting and being stupid. What's that? It. Throw like those swallows. Thank you, Bugman. Bad. Not the Bugman eat Moomoo. Hope uh, we put a stop to these things attacking your Moomoo's. Uh, I mean, Brawman. I forget anyone would attack with uh, both of us here. So is this actually the quest done, or uh, is there more? Oh, we have some dudes staring over there. Let's have a look. God, the Badarmin still doing that. Okay, so we have some dick bags over here. One of the two. See, one of two very similar-looking men. They could be twins. Both are heavily muscled and have beetling brows. Okay. What the heck are you doing out here? You here to help us or not? Might have a job for you if you're interested. Tell me about the job. Uh, well, there's the thing you could uh, do some help. Uh, we could use, use some help. <laughs> uh, what's that? Okay, here's the deal. We need some help uh, liberating some Brahmin from that idiot Tor. You can try and talk him out of the Brahmin or knock him out. Just don't hurt him too bad or stir up a ruckus. I don't think I want anything to do with that after all. Word to the wise, you better not uh, say nothing to nobody because if and you, if and you do, that would make us very angry. You don't want to see us angry. You don't want to see you angry. I don't want to see your ugly mugs at all. Goodbye. Can we tell Thor? Hmm. Dunno. Dunno who to tell about that. It's those guys are dicks. And Thor's obviously our friend. Oh, there's still a lot of, lot, lot of crabs over there. Rad scorpion limbs, that's for me. What's that? Meat jerky, oh boy. Oh man, all these fangs. I hope I didn't just rob Tor. I'm gonna completely ape shit on these scorpions though. They have entered the world of Sloyd Fu. I am sim simply too swole to complete. Right, your buggy bits, mate. Mm, rad scorpion bits. How dare you attempt to poison me, you fucking crab? There we go. Are uh, you mad? Oh, two's coming for me. Oh boy. <laughs> Fuck. 
Notice it turns my uh, excess AP into uh, into armor class between rounds. So ending the turn with two spare puts me up to 12, which is alright. Also not poisoned yet, which is also nice. What, really? But I have 50,000 strength, what's the fucking meaning? God damn. Alright, come at me, crab final. Oh, you're not, okay. Well, you died. Horribly and immediately. Such is the nature of Sloyd Fu. <laughs> you fleeing. Nah. It was but a ruse. Wait, no. Fuck. <laughs> it scoots a little bit and dies. How lovely. Oh, there we go. Now they fucked off. NP Tor, you're very lovely. God, the Brahmin, we did, didn't we? Do a great save now on ass. I'm fucking leaving Tor. Never seen a man slay so so much bullshit with one foot. Such ravenous destruction. Sussex successfully protected the Brahm. Here's Vic. That's the trader that came to us. Let's see about his store. He ain't home. It turns out he has quite a few of these. I need to sell some of all this garbage. Yeah, a lot of stuff. <laughs> the bathhouse. Might be able to sell something there. Have a bath, maybe. This thing seems a bit. My name's Sally Dunton, but mostly they call me Big No Sally. I'm the owner of this bathhouse. We have a whole hassle full of special attended baths for you to pick from. <laughs> Gee, Miss Sally, just wanted a regular bath. You don't have a bubble bath, do you? If you want an unattended bath, you might try the Golden Gecko or the Buckner House. I have no doubt they'll find that enjoyable. Thank you. I'll try that instead. I'm just kidding, I want a special, but no, I should fucking. <laughs> Notice board, let's go have a look. Hmm. Several things here. Some ads, job notices, and even a drawing. It looks like some of these have been here for a while. I guess I'll take a total close look at the drawing. Good drawing of man that looks uh, of what looks like Brahmin with a big X through it and the words for Scrabble underneath. Take a look at another notice. Something about booze. Booze got your attention, didn't it? Bum leg prevents business. Need help refueling still. Speedy and reliable type needed. See Whiskey Bob over at Ma Buckner's place. Okay. About a bath, feeling grubby, nothing makes a fellow feel better than a nice bath. Uh, three fun filled types to choose from, featuring the beautiful and talented Jenny, the late of the den, see Big No Sal at the bathhouse, more exciting details. Than fucking lizard hide. Top dollar for your top, for top pelts, you know, you have gecko pelts, I have dollar dollar dollar. Gecko pelt, uh, golden gecko pelts, especially welcome. <laughs> see me first. Hi, Owner, operator, golden gecko tavern. Okay, something about rats. Too many damn rats to trap a town. Come and get them. All you can eat. Slim. <laughs> yeah, about, uh, old stuff here. Uh, genuine antiques. Uh, they don't make him like the yuster. In fact, they mostly don't make him at all. If you want the uh, good old stuff, see Vic the trader, east side of town. So Vic's a bit of an idiot. And also gone. This is the Buckner thing. 
And here we have Sulik. See a sturdy older woman with a tired smile. Let's have a look. My name's Arden Buckner. This is my place, eh? You didn't see a trapper named Smiley outside of town, did you? Half to herself. He's been gone for too long. Never shall let him go off on that fool quest of his. Smiley, now I haven't seen Trapper. Tell me about him. While Smiley and me were getting downright serious with each other, I thought I had finally gotten him to agree to settle down here and help me run this place, but he said he needed to go off on one last quest. Quest? Well, he called it a, it a quest. He told me he uh, thought he knew where all the golden geckos came from, and he wanted to find out for sure. He thought, uh, uh, oh, sorry. Ah, fuck. He thought that maybe it was some kind of magical spring, or even maybe a hidden cave or a vault of some sort. Hmm. I don't uh, rightly know what all he said, but he seemed real excited about going. But I shouldn't have let him go. He's two weeks late. Uh, He's two weeks later getting back than he said he'd, and I'm, I'm worried. Uh, I'll go look for him for you. Oh, thank you. Let me mark it on your map where he talked about looking. I'm sure hope uh, I'm sure we can find him there. He isn't much, but I still love him and I miss him more than I thought I could. Please help me find him. Uh, I'd like to ask you something first. We're not planning any mischief here. Uh, what do you want? I'd like to buy something. Just handle rooms here, buy a trade something, talk to my daughter Maida. Okay, let's do that. Is that you up there? Nice looks on her. Uh, Maida Buckner, take care of trading and drinks here. I don't tolerate tribals messing our family place up, so just better watch your step here. You'll end up like Sue Lake. What, what do you want? Uh, I'd like to buy some things. I want some bars. I'm always looking for quality gecko pelts. Pay a good price for them. Yes, let's trade. Get rid of some all this crap. And this, for example. These also. All of these. It's pretty good. Uh, ropes always good to have. Better armor is always. Yeah. Uh, gecko pelts. Let's see if I can sell some of this other garbage. I don't know if these are important or something. Food. I think we'll probably know. Eh, only one. I'm not selling that for, for so little. Ooh, no mace here. Dose mace. One over. There we go. Nice. N fucking P. Uh, okay. How's our weight still not great? Okay, so you marked that thing on the map, so I'm actually gonna go to Vix and dump some of my stuff there for now. Hopefully, it won't disappear in that container. I'll keep a few things that we might need. The rope's probably important, that might be important. We need to show to people these weigh an ass load. I think those are the ones weighing most of the Yeah. Okay, well, let's leave town. Where's the fucking leave town area? There, I think. Or is it red that leaves properly and green transitions between areas? I forget. Map. Down here. Yeah, I guess. Go have a look for the good old Smiley, who is a swell bloke, I believe. <laughs> Toxic Caves. Lovely and inviting name. Let's have a look. Okay, we arrived at night. Let's not do that. Ah, fuck's sake. That doesn't matter, we're inside a cave anyway. <laughs> These are punches. So let's just punch him, fuck it. Double turn, motherfucker! That might not be worth it. Let's get the old feet out. Well, that was a crit. And a half. It's a golden gecko up there, I believe. It's also quite a bit nastier than the rest. Oh, there's, there's one more nastier gecko. 
run over here. Hopefully, I haven't aggroed the others. I hope to knock this one out. It's Lloyd Fu, everyone. Uh oh. Yeah, this guy has a lot of hit points. Foo. Don't know when unconscious boy gets up. Probably in a long time. Won't be a while. There we go, that's better. Oh fuck, he's back. Shit. That was about what, four turns? Five maybe? Yeah. Other one's gonna get up soon as well. We haven't damaged that one as much as this one. Two points of damage in the head. God damn. Okay, you just need to die now. How hurt are you? Almost dead. Are oh, you? Dick bag ending combat. Okay, here we go. Bonus hand to hand damage. Very nice. Faster healings, also nice. Master of fucking, kind of okay. This is also very nice. We're gonna get the bonus hand to hand damage. And more unarmed. So we may miss harder. So the two bonus thingies we're using right now are still subject to uh, the minus from uh, the other fucking thing we had. Oh god, it's back. Killed. Killed. Oh. Oh. Well. Uh, easy, I guess. So, if I recall correctly. Yeah, so these rubber boots will make us immune to the sludge, but not for fucking long. Can we nap here? Nope. Yeah. <laughs> the fuck is he? There you go. Quite a lot of these here. I believe we have Smiley on this level somewhere. Yeah, there he is. This is actually a vault. I think so. Well, 
So the problem with Smiley is, right, he, um, he doesn't do too well with the old sludge compared to us. I'm getting a lot more lucky with the unconscious crap than I thought we would. There we go. Anyway, half an hour. Time for watching. TM.